Parmadrama was a sad goodbye, uh, and, and it's it's gone now. It's over. Never to be seen again until tomorrow, when I do sort of a a best of sort of bits that. So, Parmadrama finished last week, and now it's time for international drama to finish. The international campaign we've had uh, throughout sort of the end, the latter end of the Parma career, we took the France job, and, and now we're in the final of an international tournament. So, seatbelt on. That was me clicking it in, uh, and get ready for an unforgettable ride in the uh, in the final against Italy. Bloody hell! Oh. Hi. Um, the sound messed up a little bit. This is what happens when you don't check to see if you're recording with your webcam or your microphone. So I'm really sorry that it didn't sound as good but I didn't want to not record the first version so I hope it's okay I hope you still enjoy it I won't let you know what happens just keep watching we love with care sort of post intro slash intro enjoy right then as they say it all comes down to this uh, we're playing Italy which is fantastic really considering we were offered the Italy job on the same day we were offered the France job we turned one down we took the other not just for money I don't want to clarify uh, because of two men well one man really because of Jean Monnier um, oh, that's that's the Parma team sport <laughs> Hold on. One man, Jean Monnier, who today finds himself on the bench. It's the first time he's been able to feature, uh, and he'll come from the bench. Physically suffered a little bit, it's fair to say, but he's on the bench today, uh, and this is the starting lineup we're going with. So, as you can see, everyone's tired, everyone needs long rests, uh, but I'm going to assume the other team do as well. So, I can't worry about that too much. We've got to play out the team today, which I think is capable. In fact, we're going to play on gender ahead of Shuron, and maybe we'll bring the Shuron Monnier dream team on. The only reason we're going to start with on gender is because he's match fit, uh, and we haven't got many players in that state so we'll start him uh, Jean-Claude Varane Garnier Dene uh, Shannon Pogba Gerard Lagarde <laughs> that's nice Koeman in behind on gender and Zimmer in goal so then boys it's time and girls and dads and mums and grannies and grandpas uh, it's time for the final of the Euros oh. I keep, every time I make a statement I go oh. I don't know why very excited I'm very excited I've not been this excited since the uh, the Champions League final Maybe it's just finals. Maybe that's the theme. I like finals. Uh, it's these top man then. Serafino, currently playing at West Ham. Surprisingly, has got the most goals in the tournament so far. I wouldn't say he's prolific in his career. Certainly not at West Ham anyway. Um, so yeah, I fancy our chances. Italy are a good side. A couple of familiar faces in that side. Uh, but I f again, our chances are good. Uh, Manfredini at right back. DeMarco at left back. Can't see any other players uh, of mine. No, I don't think there are any others. So, a couple of decent fullbacks that we're going to have to be wary of. All right, that is that team talk's not gone so well. Considering it's the it's the final, I feel like oh dear. Okay, well I've, I've calmly said go into the game and win. Here we are then, guys. This is what we've got and girls and mums and dads and I can't do that every time. I've got people. Here we are then, people. Right, first chance of the game. Now that Demarco cross from the left hand side, it's been. Do you know it's been fantastic for Palmer. It's now a threat, which is uh, which is a little bit ominous for me. And Manfredini on the right hand side, two players that don't look dangerous on the team sheet, but we know more than that, don't we? I wouldn't. Do you know what? Imagine if I wasn't the France manager and France came into this game, then I have no idea about those two. Well, I know a lot about them. And Chris Stig has just fouled Kingsley Coman. It's weird that I'm now managing Juventus players against Palmer players on the international stage. Is he going to get a, not even a card? Not even not a sausage. Ball played in. Oh, I, I thought there could have been a goal there. You never know. Varane now to Pogba to Lagarde. Like, oh dear. Uh, I just thought I'd show you the trophy for today's game. Looks like a water bottle. No, no, no. This is the. Uh, this is. Do you know, I'll turn it upside down. I think it looks better that way. This is the. This is the. The Euros. This is the the cup. Lagarde into the box. We nearly lifted it. I'll put it down. Anyway, we'll be lifting that towards the end of the game if we win. Lulu plays the ball in uh, and gets it back at his feet. Can we do some damage from this left-hand side? It's a place where I like to attack. Lagarde, back into the middle, please. Doesn't quite get there. Dene, Koeman was there as well. Then Ray Chan now on the edge of the box to Paul Pogba. Pogba, Lagarde. Lagarde to Angenda. Oh, I did a. I might have done a mini celebration there because I thought it scored. I don't do that very often. Corner kick, though. Koeman with the ball in. Cleared. Gerard on this right side. Well, I say right side. He's, he's moving towards the right side. He read my mind. Manfredini, though, makes the tackle and brings it away. It'll probably go all the way. And Jean Claude, I tell you what, right back, right back there, didn't it? My word. Fitness in the middle of the park. An early concern. Nothing I can do about it. Ball played up towards on gender. The, the highlights are plenty in this one, folks. I'll say that much. Shan now into Gerard to Kuman to Pog 
Bah, oh, poor Pogba. Emre Shan on it again. Koeman gets tackled. And we're not getting it. DeMarco plays it back and a clearance. But Jean-Claude is there first on the right side. Can he cause some damage? Ball played in. On gender. On gender. Oh, that was this moment. And Manfredini clears. And Lulu now back on it. Palmer teammates combining sort of on opposite sides though. And Kristig has gone through Pogba. I'll tell you what. He was warned earlier and he got away with it. That is definitely a card on this occasion. Thank you. Yellow card and a free kick to France. On gender with it. Taking it. Oh, doesn't quite go anywhere near the goal. And Verratti manages to clear it. They've had a sniff so far, not a sniff. Italy now on the attack, as I say, not created much so far. And Lagarde puts his foot in and gets there first. Kuman now, where are you going to go with it, my man? On gender, on gender, on gender, on gender, on gender, on gender. Pogba, oh my good, Gerard, oh, and there it is. One goal to the good, France won. Ludovic Gerard with the goal. Italy nil and France. I tell you what, we've had 17 shots this half. We deserve the goal. Hashtag scenes in the comment section. Thank you to those that have been keeping up with international drama. I know it's not as popular as some of the other series I've done, but you know, it's, it's nice to do something a little bit different, isn't it? Doing international save, uh, have something a little bit different to watch, sort of approach it in a different way. I certainly, are, I'm not like, I personally am not invested in the French team as much as obviously I am Palmer, and I think that reflects in people who watch. But it's it's nice to have a little journey like this, and um, it's time to make some tactical changes, a double change. I think. Right, so on gender and uh, and Cumin have done a fine job, but Sharon and Monier are gonna seal out everything we've done so far by playing up top for the final half. Let's not mess it up. Charlie's the run straight away. He's just come on the pitch. Charlie's the run. Oh, there was a chance for him. Gerard. Oh, I'll tell you what, a Monier goal would be magnificent. He missed the end of the season with Palmer, but he's not gonna miss the end of this. Here we are then. His first game back for three months, and hopefully he can get a goal. Probably should have saved those subs for like defenders and midfielders that get tired, but too late now. <laughs> Garnier to Shan, where are we going? Come on. As soon as this series finishes, I can have a shave and a haircut. Please, hurry up. Let's get a move on. I look at a disgrace. Here we are, Lagarde. Th th forward, it, forward we go. Where are we off with it? Nowhere. Uh, Lulu on it again to Lagarde on this left hand side, causing absolute havoc. So Emre Shan, ball played into the middle, perhaps. No, Shan back on it. Is he going to shoot at goal? He is going to shoot at goal. And the Liverpool man, who's now at PSG and got French nationality, has scored the goal. It's 2 0 France. And I tell you what, we're going to end the sea with the world. The end, end international drama with another trophy if things stay the same. Um, we may continue Palmer and France on stream that's an exclusive but I'll be talking about that in the next video you see well we nearly scored so I got a little I, I, did, a, I did a face I really want Sharon and Monier to get a goal really Gerard though into the box saved by uh, Providal I, I don't know what his name is it's, it's close to that Gerard another ball in 12 minutes on the clock Sharon's out there to meet it and plays it back to Gerard with plenty of space plenty of time into Shan all the way back to Varane and we're controlling the game very nicely here uh, we, we don't look in any danger of conceding we haven't all games to be honest 28 shots to their 8 shots uh, clear cut chances we've had 4 clear cut chances they've not had a single sausage Jean-Claude on the right side back to Gerard is he going to find Jean-Claude Christig puts a good foot in uh, and Varane wins the header the monstrous header that it is and the time is ticking away but Manfredini on this right side Emre Shan though he pounces on it and Monnier he's through on goal perhaps can he take on his man he can't he's going to find it maybe left no back inside to Pogba Lagarde to Chiron oh my good grief he should have scored it I thought it was in Italy in the dying embers of the game 10 minutes to go and that is their best chance so far and that says a lot so what, Pogba is knackered but he's running himself into the ground at this point Manfredini Lulu onto the ball Pogba he's just got to clear it mate don't don't try anything too extravagant you're knackered Emre Shan to Pogba to Monnier can he find his teammate? He can. Sharon forward to Gerard. Gerard now down this right hand side. Can he find the men in the middle? Back to Shan, who's controlled the game with Pogba magnificently. Sharon threw on goal and missed another opportunity. What a pity. In fact, it was a tackle and a corner kick to France. Gerard will take it. Ball played in and cleared by the Italians. They should have started a defensive. I mean, I'll end the I'll end the whole thing with look to win a game of football. There's many things you can do. The main thing you can do. Is go defensive and I think that's a motto we've failed to live by ever since about season three and there it is the champions of the European international stage the Euros is ours and I will put this next to my managers manager award from two seasons ago lovely old job and I text message I'll be I'll deal with that as well I'm sure that's about the next job team talk's gone well best one we've done for the whole tournament I think I am a prestigious man. I even got an achievement. Freedom of the country. Hopefully people don't look at that on Steam. The video's not out yet. You see your swines. There it is though. We, we've done it. We've done it. We've done it. We've done it. I'm very, very pleased. Where are the French 
the France European Championship heroes. I mean, they're in the team now. What are you on about? I know where they are. They're with me. The board are delighted. The French FA are delighted that we've won the Euros. Yeah, you'd think so, wouldn't you? I feel bad that I've sort of put a dampener on Italian football, but the, with the amount of joy I've given them, I think it was about time I took a little bit back. Anyway, folks, that will bring us to the end of international drama. If you've enjoyed this series as well as the other series I've done this year on FM six, uh, FM fifteen, hold on, FM fifteen, uh, then do leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. There'll be a few videos over the weekend. Uh, one of which will be sort of a look back at the Parma series. We'll look through some of the players. Uh, where are they now? A lot of people interested in a right back. I'll tell you all about him. Uh, and then an update on what I'm going to do for FM sixteen will come on Sunday. So we love with care from me, Doctor Benji. Until next time with FM sixteen and more content just before that release as well. There's a few other bits and pieces coming out i'll see you again good bye hopefully i don't sound like i'm in a bathroom next time <laughs> well done ben well done